Archangel Michael, we are 100% sure. November 3rd, 2016, by Christine Preston. Christine. On November 1st, I interviewed Archangel Michael because he said, Lord Michael, I am 100% sure that Donald Trump will be president. We are 100% sure he will be. Christine. I asked how they can be sure. He said, Lord Michael, by looking at the timelines, they have converged to this event. So we are 100% sure. The FBI did what was right by revealing they were reopening the investigation over Clinton's emails. Christine. I asked him about the polls and if they were accurate. He said, Lord Michael. No, the polls reported on CNN or elsewhere are all wrong. Polls are not reliable at all. They are just a tool for the establishment. The vote result will surprise many. Christine. In regard the machines that were reported to change people's votes, he said it is being investigated by the FBI and that it will be another scandal. I asked what was the emergency about. I meant the one mentioned in the previous video. Archangel Michael answered. Lord Michael. It was due to the intense opposition against the movement of liberation, even you, light workers, and Donald Trump was in danger of assassination. I repeat Donald Trump is going to be president and we are rejoicing as it is going to be the start of a new world. Christine. This morning, November 3rd, I had a communication from Archangel Michael and after a few minutes I wrote down what he had just said on a notebook I had kept next to my bed. I asked him first if I could turn round and get it as I was in a higher place in meditation, focusing on his electronic presence. I had just noticed that I was sensing some vibration, or pulsation of love, or high energy, with every words I was receiving. As previously Archangel Michael had said that he was 100% sure that Donald Trump would be elected president and that there would shortly be an announcement from Lord Sanat Kumar about the position of the solar system on the outskirts or periphery of the sphere of physical influence of the constellation of Sirius. Archangel Michael had spoken of love and given his prediction very seriously, but was also joyful and even said they were throwing a party on the higher dimensions. He then said, Lord Michael, the Syrian council is watching you like a hawk as you and the light workers of this group are at the top of the pyramid, as you have the largest vision and are pulling the others from the top of the pyramid of consciousness. Christine. What follows is my notes of what Archangel Michael said. Lord Michael. We are 100% confident that Trump is leading, and the press is being shaken to the core with evidence being released by WikiLeaks and the FBI, reopening its investigation of Hillary Clinton. In relation to the slogan Black Lives Matter, the black community needs to stop perceiving themselves as separate. It is that perception that causes problems and racism. But the forces of darkness, those in power have been repeating, suggesting to them they are the victims of persecution. They have created a museum for the remembrance of a version of history that has been quite falsified, just to inflame hate in them, or at least dissatisfaction, so they will react and cause acts of violence. Most of the white population do not entertain thoughts of dislikes or hate that could be called racist. The situation had progressed after the influence of Star Trek, but recently, you are being fed with speeches that are trying to revive the old problems. People are actually more tolerant and loving than ever before. There is an evil agenda beyond this. Many attacks, even those that have cost the life of some police officers have been engineered by some mind control program. The truth is that the population welcomes other races, and colors of skin, more than ever before even blue, green and gray. It is in galactic consciousness and those who would like to keep control but know they are losing it, have been telling the public many lies to manipulate opinion. The Dark Ones, those manipulators of the masses, this sinister force, have used skin color as a tool or weapon to divide. They have worked on mind control by amplifying the consciousness of victimization in those people who have an ancestry in connection with slavery. They see themselves as having been badly treated by the white race but this concept of having been mistreated at the hands of the white race is only part of the correct perception to have about this. What they do not perceive is the fact they were slaves at the hands of a higher class of individuals with a superiority complex, an elite in power which also mistreated the people who belonged to the same race or skin color as their own. 
kings acted as tyrants and even used their armies against the inhabitants of their own nation. This is what happened in England in past ages and the reason that I incarnated as Oliver Cromwell. It was to liberate the people from a rule of darkness. All souls evolving upon this planet have been enslaved by these dark powers, which have pulled the strings of the governments for many ages and the physical incarnation of which you know call the establishment. The problem has always been a bondage resulting with hardship, and this was particularly true 300 years ago. The people were treated as if they had little importance, or did not matter. The nature of the problem, or the way in which the anarchy was experienced, has always been social or related to class or poverty, or lack of money. I will not address other problems which are related to ideologies such as those related to extremist ones also due to a manipulation of minds and beliefs. There has been a vacuum of ignorance and misinterpretations concerning some religious legacies, so the solution is indeed to create a safe haven by more control over the borders. In general, all problems have been created by the control agenda of the elite few, who have kept mankind captive. We are putting a stop to that now. As soon as Donald Trump is president there will be a reversal of those evil forces and their influence in the whole world. He is running for office with the backup of the Galactic Federation of Light, and working to restore conditions which will bring prosperity to the American nation, and peace will be born from that. It is the work of Saint Germain through the power of the people and their constitution will be their power, and he, as well as the Archangel that I am, and the entire spiritual hierarchy, have been working on the liberation of the nations. We have been interested to bring about these liberating events, in particular since my incarnation in the 17th century to secure the power of parliament as a tool for the people and democracy. The concept born from the Greek philosopher Democrats reflected a principle held dear to the ancient Athenians. By ancient Athens I do mean a people who pre-existed the classical Greek civilization, and that already existed during the Atlantean days. They were those who opposed the establishment of the old days, as the Atlanteans were globalists who already were on the war path of a dark agenda that ended in disasters. As an extension of myself and in preparation for today's liberation, Cromwell, later called the Lord Protector, ruled for five years after a civil war that was caused by an intrusion of the royal armies upon the parliament of those days. The idea of parliament was a revolutionary innovation by the Queen of England, Elizabeth I. My work was, however, undone after I passed away, as my Puritan, Republican followers reintroduced a figure of leadership from the royal monarchy of England. They were so heinous that they demanded a death sentence upon the members of Parliament who had signed the document that had liberated the people from the monarchy's tyranny. However, this monarchy did not regain the full powers it had possessed before my intervention, so it has been said that England was never the same after Cromwell, the Lord Protector, who stated I will liberate man's souls. It was now in the hands of the Parliament and of the ministers. Therefore the powers of darkness have been unable to so easily create conditions of anarchy as they wanted, and democracy has mostly prevailed. This is what permitted Brexit, a liberation from the web of European control linked, in an intricate way, to the American establishment as the system put in place by the founding fathers of the Constitution declared in 1776, was infiltrated. Progress is however being made in the matter of the liberation of the souls of light the mystical body of God on earth. A lot of work will now be taking place to rebuild the nation. It has been a joy and pleasure for me to see the unfoldment of events. We are 100% confident that Trump is leading and the press is shaken to the core today with evidence being released once again in relation to the FBI investigations. Christine. So this was the content of the communication I have received this morning and Dark Angel Michael stopped there but he usually ends saying I am with you always. It is still important to go and vote even if you believe that it is 100% sure that victory is obtained. Keep safe and secure in the light. Namaste. Christine.